I'm going to be a firefighter by Edith Cunhart. I'm going to be a firefighter. My name is Holly. I'm at the firehouse. This is my dad. He is a volunteer firefighter. That means he's not a firefighter all the time. He works at another job. When there's a fire, he leaves his job and rushes to put the fire out. I want to be a firefighter too. Look, Daddy is bringing out the truck. My mom and my little sisters, Lisa and Emily, watch. The engine makes a big noise. We all get a little scared. Dad turns off the engine and puts on the brake. We climb onto the truck. This is a puffer truck. It carries many coiled up hoses. It pumps water onto the fire. The hoses attach to shiny valves. Dad wears a radio on his belt so that wherever he is, he can hear if there's a fire. Dad shows me a pike, a pike pole, an axe, and a pry bar. These tools help firefighters get inside a burning house or a car. Dad carries his turnout gear in his truck. His boots, his coat, and his helmet are in a red bag inside a box. Extra turnout uniforms are kept on the fire truck. Dad tries on his turnout uniform. Then Lisa and I try it on. At home, we practice what to do if there's a fire. We crawl on the floor where the smoke is less thick. We feel the door to see if it's hot. If it is hot, we don't open that door because there might be fire on the other side. We escape out a window. Thank goodness this window is on the first floor. We decide ahead of time where to meet outside the house. Our family's meeting place is under this big tree. One night, a voice on Daddy's radio says there's a fire. A voice tells exactly where the fire is. Daddy gets the keys to his truck and runs out the door. He drives straight to the fire. At the same time, the other volunteer firefighters leave their homes and jobs. They rush to the firehouse, they jump onto the fire truck, and drive to the fire. The fire is in a store. Daddy puts on his turnout uniform. He helps another firefighter put on an oxygen tank. And with the tank and a mask, the firefighter will be able to breathe if he goes into that store. The firefighters attach hoses to the pumper truck and they spray water on the fire. The fire is out. No one is hurt. There was no one in the store. Dad coils up the hose and the firefighters put their equipment in the truck. They drive back to the firehouse. Good night, they say. They are tired, but they've done a good job. The next morning we have breakfast. Dad gets up late. When he joins us at the breakfast table, he tells us about the fire. He shows us how the flames shot up in the air. My dad is brave. After breakfast, Lisa and Emily and I go out to play. Can you guess what we played? I'm going to be a firefighter. I'm going to be a firefighter.